Now, Canada has announced a two-year cap on the intake of foreign students. This, as an explosive growth in the number of international students in recent years, has aggravated the housing shortage in the North American nation. About 40% of foreign students in Canada come from India, and prospective Indian students are said to be heavily impacted by the decision. Canada's immigration minister said the government will introduce a temporary two-year cap on student visas, and this will result in the issue of just around 364,000 visas this year. Last year, Canada issued nearly 1 million study permits. Government data shows 2023's numbers were about three times that of a decade ago. The new proposals also restrict spouses of international students enrolled in other levels of study. The new decree will also set limits on postgraduate work permits issued to foreign students. The permits were previously seen as an easy path to securing permanent residency. The Canadian government says the acceptance of new study permits applications in 2025 and will be subject to reassessment at the end of the current year. Canada has emerged as a popular destination for international students since it is easier to obtain work permits after finishing courses. But the surge in international students led to acute shortage in rental apartments which pushed up rents and reports indicate that just in December rents across the nation rose 7.7% from the year prior. Meanwhile, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's popularity has taken a hit mainly due to the affordability crisis. Canadian universities are set to negatively impact to be impacted by this move, pardon me, and the international students bring them about 16.4 billion US dollars annually. Many institutions had also ramped up their campuses in the hope of a continued inflow of students, and some businesses, including restaurants and retail sectors, have warned that a cap on foreign students will create a shortage of temporary workers.